Sometimes a few words of encouragement are all that's needed to turn belief into reality. Sometimes the Cowboys players make appearances. I found out that Demarcus Ware was going to be at um, the grocery store. My boys were about four years old at the time. And Tyler looked at Demarcus Ware and he said, do you think I'd ever be able to play football? And Demarcus said, you know what? If you put your mind to it, you can do anything that you want. And Tyler looked at me and he says, I want to play football. They think because I have one hand, they think, oh, that guy's not going to be good. When I first started playing sports, I thought I wasn't going to be good either. But then once I actually got the hang of it, I got way better. He gets questioned every single year. It's the same thought that goes through their head. How does he even play? He's missing his hand. He wants to be good at it. He's not out there because, hey, look at the guy with one hand playing football. He's trying to win, and he's trying to be good at his position. He's an offensive lineman that knows how to communicate. He's calling out which guys are supposed to block. He's really taking control of the offensive line. Right, here we make a play now. Still, make a play when it's here. Tyler Sampson was born with an underdeveloped right arm, which made him an introvert as a child. He was a very shy boy, and he still is a little shy. And football, I think, made him more outgoing. But it's also therapeutic for Tyler. And when he became good at it, it did nothing but raise his confidence and his self-esteem. I don't care what position I play, I just want to play on the field. His confidence was high enough to share his story, which led to Tyler becoming a local celebrity. There's someone else North Texas fans should root for. It's Tyler Sampson. He's from Griffin Middle School. A Frisco football player's inspiring story has earned him a shot at going to the Super Bowl. I love this story. He is now one of the ten finalists for this competition. So give it up for Mr. Ty Sampson. He is very comfortable in his own skin. A lot of people in middle school don't always have the most positive self-image, and he does. We've taught him, when he talks to others, to always be open about it. The first thing you do is say, this is the way I was born. This is Lefty. He's, he's the mean one, and Tiny is the nice one. Whenever Tyler does something that he shouldn't have done, he's like, it's, it was Lefty. I know he's used his prosthetic as a club against his brother. We've got to get on him without that. He wants us to be another kid out there, another football player out there that's getting the job done. I think with football, he truly feels like he is just one of the team. He's not different. See that pancake block? Tyler has told me before, he says, Mom, I don't want to be known for being good for missing an arm. I just want to be known for being good. So what one of the uh, amazing things have you gotten to do? I've been able to go on the news and be able to like, like tell people about my story. I have one last question for you. Who is your, who would you say is your favorite NFL player? DeMarcus Square. That's cool.
journey to the Super Bowl. Like the rest of us, they will watch as football crowns a new champion. The but the story of our game is ongoing. Whether we are playing, coaching, supporting, or just watching, we are all a part of football America. And today is our national holiday. There's something about a Super Bowl, the anthem is ending, the plane comes over, all the flashbulbs, and that's a miracle. If you're around the world and you're watching that, I think you go, you know what? I get it. America's pretty cool.